Hello everybody, it's Matt again at the Gourmet Cafe. Tonight I'd like to show you how to make orchetti carbonara. We start off with bacon. And what we'd like to do here is you want to have the top piece where the meat is off the pan. So when it comes out of the pan, it's not going to stick and you're going to lose the meat. So that's just an easy technique to use. Also, you don't want to, uh, when you're cooking at home, it avoids all that splatter of bacon grease on your stovetop and you don't have to clean it up. So this is how we do that. We separate it right here, all right? And now this is going to go in the oven. And when it comes out, we take two slices and we chop it up. So we have onions, bacon, peas, grated cheese, heavy cream, all right? So we're just going to cut a little onion. So we're going to do onions and bacon about equal parts, right? So we're going to start here. A little oil. We're going to brown that onion first. We're going to put our peas in with our pasta, which has been blanched already. So we're just going to put that in the hot water. This is uh, done by request, by the way, for the Lucibellas. So look for that. Okay, so now we're going to slot our bacon in. That goes to incorporate. So this is one order that we serve here. So what I do is I just pour the heavy cream to a count of four. One, two, three, four. You want to let the cream get hot before you add the cheese. Because if you add the cheese too soon, it's going to go to the bottom and burn to the pan. So once the cheese is nice and bubbly, I mean, once the cream is bubbling, we're going to shake in that grated cheese. And we're going to use our spoon to just swirl it around. Okay, now we're going to turn the heat off. We're going to add our pasta to the hot water. Ten seconds in the water is all you need. Let the water drain out. I'm going to add that now. I'm going to put on a low heat and I'm going to adjust the consistency. So I'm going to add a little bit of vegetable stock, chicken stock. You might have to add a little more grated cheese. You don't need to add the salt because salt, you already have cheese in there and that's salty. So we're just gonna add a little black pepper. Okay. Carbonara, gourmet cafe style. Bon appetit.